Well, welcome everyone to our 30 day clean eating challenge um, Zoom presentation. Um, we are going to have just a great, uh, you know, 20 to 30 minutes here as we just talk about the overview of our 30 day clean eating challenge that truly is changing lives. And so the exciting thing about our program is it's really, as you'll learn, it's really truly not a fad diet. It's a really, truly teaching maintenance from day one. And so I'm just going to go over some slides, but then uh, most importantly, I'm going to really, um, you know, pass over the mic, if you will, to some people who've had some phenomenal results with our program. And so, um, so yeah, so what to expect from the 30-day program? Well, for one, um, excitingly, as a mom of five, I have more energy now than I've ever had. And we all wear so many various hats, um, from wife to mom to, you know, business owner, that energy is just key to our day and to our success. And so that has been, for me, one of the most amazing things that this uh, program has done. It truly has been, for me, a jump start to a healthier me. And that I can't even begin to put a price tag on. And so, um, like I had mentioned, this isn't a fad diet or a rapid weight loss program. Um, you know, the 30-day clean eating will truly reveal foods um, to you that are sabotaging your health. And it's really... Uh, reprogramming your body to effectively remove these toxins, these toxins that are sabotaging us, and reset the reset our metabolisms, but really kind of cool, um, really reduce the cravings um, that we're, we're feeling. And so um, we're not about counting calories, um, no points or anything like that. Um, and truly, um, light exercise is suggested, but it's not required. Um, because they say you cannot out exercise a bad diet. And so, um, you know, the great thing about our plan, we provide coaching. Uh, we have a fi private Facebook group that really is interactive and really giving you that daily support. So there's not any place that you need to report to every day. You've got encouragement education, really truly educating you up why we're, you know, making that shift in our dietary choices. We have weekly meal plans, shopping list, shopping lists, and um, much more. And so we actually truly really teach you that, that clean eating, um, it tastes good and it's not boring. So um, that's pretty cool. And we really are teaching you what foods to remove that have been clinically proven to cause an acidic inter interior. And what we're truly trying to do is really reverse that acidity back into that alkalinity. And we'll talk a little bit more about that. Um, but we're going to talk about, you know, removing these, these foods and we're going to talk about what those are and um, really talking about why they're causing negative effects on our body. Um, we are going to increase our nutrient, uh, uh, nutritional in intake. We're going to talk about balancing our blood sugar levels, and this program really does support our elimination organs and um, effectively remove toxins from the body. And, um, you know, when toxins are removed from the body, um, that's when the fat can actually melt away. So um, eliminating toxin equals fat being flushed out of the, the body, which is something that I really want you to, to hear and grab, grab onto. Um, and then we're going to talk about how to reincorporate um, food back into our diet after these 30 days so we can really see which of the foods that we've um, asked you to eliminate are really causing intolerances in our body. And so... We all really need to detoxify. You know, I, I, there's um, some people on my team that, that, are call, that call themselves the skinny unhealthy, right? Um, and so it's not necessarily about your weight. Um, we, can be, we can be thin and unhealthy. Um, and a toxin really is anything in your body that cannot, uh, that your body cannot use as energy. 
And one of those is a GMO. GMO stands for genetically modified organism. And these are plants that have been changed um, on a on molecular level. And really your body cannot recognize them. And so really um, looks at them as a toxin. They, they cannot be used as energy. And so that's a big reason why we're telling you to stay away from genetically modified um, foods. And um, toxins can not only just come from your food, it's your environment, your skin care, um, your hair care, anything you're putting on your, your skin actually goes into your bloodstream within less than a minute. And so that is something also on our plan that we'll you know, tell you to take a look at. Um, this is truly a detoxifying pro program from the inside out. And so um, one of the things that I was mentioning before is, um, you know, once we detoxify, the fat just flushes out of our body, right? Because our body is very, very smart. And when we have toxins in our body, actually, it's someone has, has looked at it as bubble wrap. Our fat cells actually... Um, surround the toxins and they're stored in our um, fat cells to really help our vital organs. Um, that's actually why they're called vital, right? We're, they're, they're vital to our survival. And so our body is actually bubble wrapping um, those toxins um, in, in our fat cells. And in women, a lot of times they show up on our hips and our thighs and our buttocks. And in men, a lot of times the stomach area. Um, and so uh, you know, this program helps to eliminate those toxins. And then again, like I mentioned, to flush, um, flush those, that fat away. Um, and if we become overloaded with toxins from processed food, chemicals from body care, skin care, pesticides, um, it can affect and does affect how our body functions properly. And so um, basically everybody needs a tune-up is really what we say. So clean eating, really we focus on eating real food. So um, we not, like I said, not only have um, the recipes, but we have the shopping list, vegan and non-vegan um, meals. And, um, you know, they're grass-feed beef without the hormones or antibiotics, uh, free-range chicken, turkey that are, um, uh, that are not fed uh, hormones or antibiotics cage-free eggs, wild salmon, organic fruits and vegetables, um, and then healthy, complete carbohydrates like brown rice, quinoa, um, sweet potatoes. And then we also incorporate healthy fats, olive oil, coconut oil, avocado, almond butter, um, to you know, mention a few. And so clean eating really does equal an anti-inflammatory diet. And um, it's the acidity that we are, you know, causing in our body that's causing this inflammation. And our, tr our program truly um, has proven results for getting rid of that inflammation. And you'll hear just in a moment. So, um, so many of the common foods we eat have negative effects on our body. And, you know, we're just chalking this up to normal, right? Um, the FDA and just our society really is not helping us as um, the European standards. There's just things that they, you know, refuse to do that are just common here in the United States. And um, did you know that foods you eat can cause drainage, such as stuffy nose, allergy, bloating, gas? And these are all things that people have seen such a positive effect of reversing these things when they go on our 30-day clean eating challenge. And um, typically the foods that we most crave are commonly the ones that are causing these negative effects in our body. And so basically we are, we are encouraging people to remove these foods that aren't serving us. And, um, you know, so we're looking for, you know, no preservatives or addictive foods, no, you know, foods without pesticides or hormones or antibiotics. Um, no dairy or gluten or corn or soy or whey, which whey is just a derivative of dairy. No refined sugar, no coffee or, and no alcohol. And I know this is a big one for so many people, like no coffee, are you kidding? Um, but we have healthy substitutes that 
in the long run, people have um, just been so pleased that they have stayed the course and stayed away from that coffee for 30 days. Um, no artificial flavors or sweeteners, no white foods, no potatoes, no white rice, no white uh, flour or white sugar, sugar, and then um, no vinegar except apple cider vinegar. And you're going to see that we have um, substitutes for all of this. Um, this program is all about educating you of you know, these things that are actually truly creating an acidic environment inside of us. And we replace those with healthy choices that actually taste good, that are bringing back that alkalinity and um, taking away that inflammation in our system. Um, so, you know, we said no refined sugar. Um, so, you know, but why? What's wrong with that, right? Well, daily intake of sugar can cause an acidic estate. It's proven fact that white sugar makes us acidic. And when, when we are acidic, our body is actually leaching, um, you know, precious vitamins and minerals from our bones and from, from our body. Um, dairy causes bloating, gas, and belly pain, but not only that, but it also has been proven to um, create that acidic environment. And um, with dairy, only 30% of the calcium in milk is being absorbed. And by making healthier choices, like a cup of broccoli or leafy greens, you actually get twice as much calcium. So there's so much power in actually knowing and, and the knowledge of what's going on in our body when, when we understand how things are you know, being absorbed. Um, we talked about whey being a derivative of dairy. Um, there's a lot of whey shakes. And again, um, that's producing an acidic environment where our Arbonne shakes are um, plant-based and they have up to an 80% absorption rate. So gluten, what's wrong with gluten? They say that there's an estimate of 50% of the population has some sort of intolerance with gluten. It's very difficult to digest. And it, plain and simple, causes inflammation. It decreases the immune system, and that's the last thing we need, right? Um, causes loss of energy, clogs sinuses, and slows weight, and slow, um, there's just a slow weight gain. So soy, um, it's a highly processed crop. It's acidic as well. Difficult to digest, but also um, it mimics the effect of female hormones. It actually, soy has been linked to a lot of males um, growing breast buds, young, young, you know, boys as well as men. And um, so that's just a good thing to, to stay away from. And so our program truly does correct our pH because although our skin should be a little bit acidic, our internal body should not be. It should be a little bit alkaline. And so um, what we're doing with this is we're actually reverting that um, acidity that most people are feeling. All you have to do is turn on the, the TV these days to see the tum to tum tums, right? It's, it's um, you know, just putting a Band-Aid over what we're feeling where this plan is really going towards, towards the root of the cause of what we're actually putting in our body. Um, so everything we put in our mouth is filtered through our liver and everything we put on our skin is absorbed in the bloodstream in less than a minute. So it's not just what we're putting on our mouth. It's also what we're putting on our skin. And, um, you know, Arbonne's products, um, correct the pH inside and out. Our, um, skincare products maintain that ac acidic mantle that doctors, um, call your outer skin, your acid mantle and protects that internal balance of that alkalinity. And so um, balancing your blood sugar, um, eating sugar and acidic carbohydrates, it causes the body to secrete insulin and insulin signals the body to bring the blood sugar down and to hold on to fat. Um, low blood sugar causes cravings, okay? And so our um, program really helps to um, maintain and stabilize those blood sugar levels um, just through um, eating regular intervals, but also our vegan shakes 
have been clinically proven to help um, balance your blood sugar levels throughout the day when you have those in the morning. And our program truly does support our, your elimination organs, right? So we've got so many toxins we're putting in our body. Um, our kidney and liver has over 500 functions um, you know, a day for detoxifying. Um, and the kidney filters over 200 quarts of blood every day. And they say that our intestinal tract can hold between 5 to 25 pounds of waste at any given time. And so we're going to talk a little bit more about how our plan helps um, all these organs, right? Our, our kidney and our liver and our intestinal tract to really eliminate and really work at top function to really give us what we call um, that 30-day tune-up. And so um, how does Arbon really fit in with our Pure Safe and Beneficial products? Well, one, all of our products are alkaline forming, pH correct, low glycemic certified, vegan certified, and our um, standards that exceed the FDA. And so um, the products are all formulated without animal products, animal byproducts, um, dairy, gluten, soy, no GMO, um, cholesterol, trans fats, art no artificial colors or flavors or sweeteners. And um, when you look at the whole package here on the screen that comes along with our, our um, you know, links that will not only tell you what not to eat, but gives you that, uh, those step-by-step -step recipes, um, and then gives you these tools for support. And I'll go all, over all of these tools. You'll see um, the two bags of shakes. These are... Um, 60 servings or 60 meals of um, vegan uh, shake made of brown rice, cranberry, and um, yellow pea. And it's the cran cranberry actually that makes it a complete protein um, coupled with um, our fiber that you see there right in the middle. Um, most Americans are only getting four grams of fiber. Fiber is like your Pac-Man that goes through your intestinal tract. Um, you know, pulling out the sugars and the toxins, and one scoop of our fiber is um, 12 grams, which is almost half of what you need in your daily serving. We also have our detox tea, which is phenomenal. Remember we said that um, your liver has over 500 functions and your, um, and your kidney with, um, you, know, you know, purifying the blood, uh, 200 gallons of blood a day, right? Um, this formulation of detox tea has milk thistle and peppermint and um, nine other herbs that is just you know uh, optimal for really ensuring that your your organs are functioning uh, effectively and um, you know we mentioned about the um, the coffee stepping away from caffeine and sodas um, we have our fizzy energy drinks which are one of my favorites right um, we have um, citrus flavor, we have pomegranate flavor, but they are um, vitamin B energy drinks that um, not only are helping to boost your energy, but they um, have been clinically proven to up your metabolism, to um, increase your mental focus, and they've been clinically proven to help um, alkaline your system. So again, that's reverting that acidity that most people are feeling back to that alkalinity. We have our Digestion Plus, which is the bomb. You know, so many people know about probiotics or have heard about probiotics. Um, it's that good bacteria. You know, after age 40, we're producing um, roughly 40% less of the good bacteria that we need in our system. And so um, this probiotic um, not only is a probiotic that has been proven with its patent um, coating to survive your stomach acid, because most probiotics don't survive your stomach acid. It has a prebiotic that is feeding your probiotic once it gets to your intestinal tract. And then it's um, coupled with um, 12 different essential enzymes that are helping to break down your food. And when you consider that 80% of our immunity is in our gut, 
80% of our serotonin for mood is produced in our gut. Um, you know, our, our sex drive is, is you know, essential um, for, you know, with a healthy gut. And there's so much going on with having a healthy gut um, from our health of our skin that that is just an amazing, phenomenal product. Um, and then last but not least, we have our seven-day cleanse. And um, this is, is just a phenomenal formulation that you take um, along with food that is really pulling the toxins out of the deep tissues of the organs. And so we have step-by-step -step instructions on how to incorporate all this um, in our 30-day program. And um, with that, I would really like to um, turn it over to some phenomenal, um, just people that have gone through our program to share some of the results that they've experienced. And so um, I'd like to ask Cherie um, to, to um, share first, if you would. So welcome, Cherie. All right, it's my, I'm first, and it's my first time sharing. Great, I love it. Thank you, um, thank you so much for everything. Um, it's nice to hear it all again after I've been through it. I'm like, yes, I did that, I eliminated all of that, and I really do feel amazing. Um, I would have, um, first of all, I thought I was gonna die when <laughs> Kevin and Angela told me I had to give up coffee. I love it. I'm like the coffee queen, three or four cups of coffee a day. And I, I was pretty much always staying jacked up on it. And after this, um, giving it up, I would, you have to wonder, why am I having to drink four cups of coffee? What is wrong with me that I felt like I needed it to be normal? Um, so I did survive. No coffee, no bread, no dairy. And I do feel amazing. Um, as a byproduct of that, I lost um, 10 pounds in the 30 days, which was which was good. I, I was, I thought I was pretty healthy before this and was really surprised that I had any kind of, um, weight loss since I've always done everything. I did the 4-HB, I did the keto, I did the low calories. Um, I was thought that I wasn't happy with, with myself. I just, um, knew I could be healthier and I, I, I love food. So I was always trying different things. So I didn't have any big health issues or any big drive to do it. I just thought I'd give it a try. And um, I was really surprised um, coming out of the 30 days how amazing I felt. So at the end of the day, um, when I'm done with work and the kids and, and the dog, I still have another couple hours um, left in me to just do the things that I want to do in the day, which was which is amazing because I would just crash and burn from the coffee, really not want to get up off the couch. And I thought I was fine, like, well, because I'm busy. But no, there's, there, was way more, um, there was way more to life than what I was living. And I'm really, really glad that I did the program. Uh, my husband did it and he lost 15 pounds. Um, he also got off, saved us $400 in his monster addiction. Wow. Um, <laughs> um, he quit his monster, 400 that I'm aware of, about four monsters a day. He may have been doing more, um, but he transitioned over to the Fizz Sticks, and um, it's cheaper and it's healthier for him, and his mood has improved so much. Like, he is, like, calm and back to, like, the jolly, friendly man that I know, not on edge from being hyped up on monster all the time. Like wow. he would snap like that if something like he would just was so, um, I can't even describe it, but the fistics really helped him <laughs> with that. And it's made my life better because he's happier, um, and the weight loss. And my sister also did it and she lost 13 pounds in the first week, wow. um, just cutting things out. So it's a great program. I don't want to take up too much time because I could talk about it forever. Um, because it is really is life changing. I'm super glad. One thing I do want to add everything I've ever done in my life. I did it really hard for like four weeks, five weeks. I pushed myself as hard as I could to follow it. Cause I'm a rule follower. Um, and then I would just break down, couldn't do it, um, anymore. And then all the bad habits would come back. I'd gain the weight. I would just feel crappy on top of feeling emotionally and psychologically beaten from failing. Um, and this, after the 30 days, I have a new relationship with food and that's the best mm -hmm. to be released from having cravings from food controlling me. 
And that's just been amazing. So I, I will never go back. I um, love food that feels, that loves me back. And I'm not controlled by it at all. And it's, it's amazing. So thank you for sharing it with me and make me do it. Cause I almost went with the skincare. I was like, not <laughs> let me wash my face. On it. I love it. I love it. So that's, that's awesome. I, I love, um, you know, hearing about your husband's mood because that is something that happened when my husband went on it too. And I'm just saying you can't put a price on that, right? Because, uh, so great. And uh, with that, I know you said you're never going to go back. Uh, I'm going to transition to Kevin King, who's been, um, you know, graduate, I guess you could say, of our program for over two years now. And so, Kevin, would you like to share? Absolutely. Um, so, like Cherie was saying, that she felt like she was already, you know, eating, you know, right and healthy. Well, I was a hot mess um, at the time. Um, I weighed 40 pounds more than I do now, but l l let me let me start over. I was I was a corporate officer. I did business lunches, business dinners, and happy hours, and that was kind of my lifestyle. And I had done yo-yo diets to lose weight, um, but what would end up happening after that that period of time? I would gain it back plus some. Um, I was on four different medications for over 10 years. I had issues with my liver. I had NASH, which um, was moving into cirrhosis of the liver, where uh, Bethesda Naval Hospital wanted to put me on a study. And so my wife referred to me as a hot mess. I guess, I guess that, that's what I was, I was a hot mess. But I had told her probably about four months prior to doing the program that um, I am what I am, and I'm not going to do any more yo-yo dieting. I give up. If there's anything else that goes wrong with me, they'll have a medication for it. So that's where I was in life. And so she introduced this program by saying she was going to do the 30-day clean eating, and she wanted me to support her. And of course, I'm going to do it, especially when she's going to be cooking and everything else. <laughs> um, but... It, well, when Cherie said life changing, that's absolutely 100% what happened to me. So throughout the, the 30 days, and I won't say that the first week was easy because I didn't drink coffee, but I was drinking diet soda and I was addicted to sugar. And I had eight ladies that uh, worked in the office that loved to bake and loved to bring in cookies and all had candy dishes. And I visited each one at least two times a day. So uh, anyhow, that, that was kind of my diet. <laughs> and so it, it was hard. It was hard to go 30 days. Uh, but after the 30 days, not only did I lose 20 pounds and I felt great and I wanted to keep going because I had never felt so alert and so much energy um, that the second month I continued on and I lost another 20 pounds. And I came off, after going to the doctor and going through a physical, I came off of all my medications. And um, probably about a year and a half ago, I went to the liver specialist again and said that every, all my issues with my liver had changed and they no longer needed to see me anymore. So anyhow, life changing, absolutely. Um, like Sheree, I'm never going back and I appreciate food. And um, I, I, I didn't really change. I just cut out the, the process, nasty stuff that's really bad for you. And I have a whole new appreciation for a nice grass-fed burger or, um, you know, some uh, good seafood, you know. Um, and I always love chicken. So just get the range-free range chicken. Um, anyhow, that, that's kind of my story. I, I could have stopped after listening to Cherie because, you know, she said it 100% better than me. Life changing. Yes, it is. Mm, thanks, Kevin. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I love the power of the team and just um, the different stories from, you know, all areas of the nation, but also just, um, you know, everyone just kind of has a different story. And um, I would love for Susie to share um, if you have a moment, Susie. Um, I'm here. Great. I've got a bunch of moments. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> hey, uh, I can uh, uh, go along with 
just what Sheree and Kevin said. I've heard um, Kevin's story many times, just like my own. And um, I was, um, I don't, I didn't consider myself a mess because I'm, I'm a senior citizen. I've lived a great life and, you know, um, go a lot of places, do a lot of things. And then boom, when the doctor tells you something's wrong with you, it's kind of scares you to death, you know, and I did have something wrong with my liver. And uh, so when Stephanie, my daughter, got into Arbonne, I had decided a little later uh, to join her as a partner. And that's when she said, Mom, well, if you're going to get into Arbonne, you've got to go on the 30-day program, nutritional program. And I said, oh, no, what are you talking about? And, um, well, take that back just a step because Stacy also hit me first when <laughs> she was down in Atlanta. And uh, I said, well, you know, forget that. I, I just went along with them. You know how you do your kids. You say, okay, yeah, I'll do it. And uh, so anyway, she stuck me to it and I did it. And uh, I have to say I was a new person. I, um, I've i been on um, uh, the clean eating program, uh, certainly not every day and cer certainly not every month, but uh, uh, for on and off a, a year, over a year. And uh, what was so remarkable, I have to go f for a um, uh, liver enzymes test and everything every six months where they draw blood and I, they don't just get one, they get three vials of blood from me. And um, so my specialist said, oh my gosh, he said, uh, Miss Russell, he said, what have you been doing? And I said, what do you mean? He said, well, you've lost weight. <laughs> and I said, yeah, I've done that. And he said, uh, you know, he got back my blood work because I always meet with him again. And plus the bad thing about it, he's a member of my church. So he sees me all the time. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so anyway, he said that my alkaline levels were not normal, but they had just dropped drastically. And uh, y'all don't know how I felt. I'm telling you, it really meant a lot to me, you know, to, that some program, because I've been just like you, Sheree, I've been on Weight Watchers. I've been on... Um, Oh my gosh, any kind of bad diet you want. I, I tried it all, you know, even diet pills back in the day. <clears throat> and so uh, I have to say it's really, um, our nutrition program is just awesome. And uh, talking about fizz sticks, um, you know, it's funny how people see, they, I heard this the other day, I'm one of the girls talking um, on YouTube and she said, you know, uh, use that lotion, use that and, People are going to ask you what that stuff is. Well, by gosh, you wouldn't believe people will ask me what a fizz stick is. What are you doing? And uh, I said, well, I'm getting this energy. And uh, by the way, I do do Zumba. And it's not on um, chair Zumba. It's not for granny Zumbas. It's the real thing. And I do it three days a week. So I'm keeping up. And um, I just um, think that, you know, I wish we could get everybody all these healthy, because my family's just like most of your families, you know, you see them that is gorging in, you think, oh my God. And uh, you want to tell them, just please, please. And some of them you do, and then they look at you like you're crazy. And then others, my brother uh, and Donna, one of our consultants, they've been doing the nutrition program and they're just doing awesome awesome and he has uh he has cancer he had cancer of the throat and so he just lives by they have their shakes every day every day and it's amazing how uh, after you've been and i know you can attest to this kevin most of you can boy if you go get off that diet and like we were out west and had to eat oh um, and we had to because we had we left one restaurant it was horrible so we went, the only place open that we could get into was a Mexican restaurant. Oh my God, I thought I was up half the night. I was dying. <laughs> I mean, you know, you're not used to eating that kind of stuff. And it's like, oh, I was told Bruce, I said, I'm just dying here. And it's amazing, you know, um, uh, how your body has changed so drastically. And you don't realize it until you do something like that, you know? And uh, so I just... Um, I love our nutrition program and, and I hope that I can continue, you know, to um, tell, tell the world, tell everybody about it. 
And oh, by the way, I did get a girl on our nutrition program and she lives in Brazil now. I'm having to buy the Arbonne and ship it to her. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. But, yay. That's awesome. That's awesome. Well, I just, I just really want to thank everyone for sharing tonight. Um, Dr. Chris Gast, um, who's an oncologist from Arkansas, was going to jump on tonight. But just, just briefly, her story, um, she w had um, suffered from fibromyalgia for 20 years and went on her 30-day clean eating challenge for one month and to date has not had any of her symptoms return. And so she's got a bunch of amazing stories that she st shares as well as she's um, then taken a lot of her cancer survivors through this plan and just the success that they've had um, with their neuropathy has been amazing. And um, so I just want to encourage you, if you're, if you're watching live and, and you're a guest or if you're watching the recording, um, to get with the person who invited you um, to take a look at our 30-day clean eating plan, for less than $10 a day for a month, you truly can change your life. And like Cherie um, spoke about, I mean, she's got an extra two hours of her day um, that she's energized and ready to you know, just really enjoy life. And uh, that's really what we can do with this 30-day clean eating plan. Um, when you feel like a seven or an eight or a nine, you can truly live life to the fullest, whether you're on vacation or at work or being a mom or a dad or you know, just whatever you're, you're leaning into in life, you can do it to the fullest. And that's what this plan actually allows us to do. So thanks for joining on tonight. And again, just get with the person who invited you and come and make 2018 the best year of your life. And so with that, I want to thank everyone for joining us. So I'm going to stop the share. And 